What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the new and improved High Society Gaming. I am Nate here and today we are going to be playing Uncharted 3 Drake's Deception on the Nathan Drake Collection on the PS4. Uh, I decided to start with the uh, Nathan uh, Drake's Deception just because it was my favorite game out of the entire series and also since Uncharted 4 is going to be coming out in April, I felt that I actually had no time to even uh, keep the bonus charges from the loaded game for this new game. Sure, why not? Why, and actually, yeah, sure, why not? So, continuous run speed run? No, let's just do the campaign. So, I just wanted to uh, get the last. Ooh, let's let's do hard. Just 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 because. Um, we actually like I, I was trying to say. I kept trying to say. Uh, this since this is the uh, prior game to Uncharted 4, I felt it would be appropriate to do this one because I did wouldn't have enough time to actually get all three of them done by April. So. I'm gonna sit back, be quiet, and watch the cutscene, and I'll be back in a minute. All men dream, but not equally. Those who dream by night, in the dusty recesses of their minds, wake in the day to find that it was vanity. But the dreamers of the day are dangerous men, for they may act their dream with open eyes to make it possible. This I did. Hands up. Enjoying yourself, pal? Oh, yeah, you're a comedian. Nice warm welcome. They're both clean. My apologies. One can't be too careful. I'm guessing you're Talbot? Mr. Sullivan. And Mr. Drake. That's right. Do you have it? Let's, uh... See the money first. Cut out. It's all there. Now let's see it. I'll need to authenticate it. Of course. Silver. 16th century, Elizabethan design, inscribed with Sir Francis Drake's motto. Well, it appears to be genuine. Well, of course it's genuine. If I may ask, how did you two come into this? Does it matter? <laughs> My client will be very pleased. Hold on a minute. Sully, this is fake. I assure you, Mr. Drake. Oh, oh, you are right. This is phony as a three-dollar bill. What the hell are you trying to pull here? Perhaps I should be asking you. This is bullshit. Deal's off, pal. And you? You can tell your client. You blew it. Come on, Nate, let's get the hell out of here. You're not really in a position to negotiate. Now give me the ring, take the case, and walk out of here like gentlemen. While you still can. Do as the man says, son. You're a thief. Well, now, that's ironic. Alrighty. 
<laughs> Let's get into it. Oh man, I absolutely adore this game. I, I got it the first day it came out back in what, like 2011? And I completely, oh, I just absolutely love it. I remember, I think I played at least 15 days into the actual multiplayer. And I'm, I'm, I got the uh, Nathan Drake collection because I wanted to uh, get the Uncharted 4 multiplayer, like, beta pass. And uh, I was actually going to make videos on it, but um, like I said in my last video, uh, there was a few months where I just wasn't able to uh, just emotionally make videos just because I just wasn't ready for it. But now I'm ready to get back into it, and <laughs> I really did miss it. Oh, man, this is... Honestly, just a nice stress reliever. So, the only thing I'd miss about the Nathan, or I don't like about the Nathan Drake collection, is that they don't have any multiplayer maps in it. Which I mean, I was kind of hoping for, but it's okay either way because the campaigns are just absolutely fantastic. And a lot of people say that Uncharted 2, they prefer Uncharted 2 over Uncharted 3, and in all honesty, I don't think so. Just because, I mean. I, I think the villain Uncharted 2 is definitely a lot better, but Uncharted 3, if you just if you play them back to back, they have it, 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 I can't really explain it. The cinematic approach to the actual game, like this part right here, like that type of stuff wasn't in the second game. Like there's just the cinematic visuals, like it's an actual movie. Like the other ones played out like actual movies, but the but they weren't like as cinematic as this one. And I just, like all the camera angles and you get when, while you're fighting and stuff like that right there. It's just, it's honestly very uh, intuitive. And I very much enjoy it. So, I was playing this game. I mean, I was just binge playing this game up until Fallout 4 came out. In all honesty, <laughs> of all the times I've played this game, I've never thrown anyone out the window before. <laughs> oh, man. So, I mean, I don't know what I'm going to try to do when it comes to videos. I think I'm going to try to make it like a 20-minute time limit or so. But, I mean, if I can, I'll try to get through one chapter per video because they're very, uh, very, they're fairly lengthy, but they shouldn't be too long. Man. That is nasty. Come on. And the acting in this game is just absolutely second, superb. Baby. I can never get over it. Oh crap. <laughs> Sorry my voice sounds kind of coarse and rough actually. I think I'm getting I'm getting sick. I don't know for sure though. So ready for more. <laughs> there we go. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh. You know, I mean, like, the, honestly, the biggest thing I'm, like, excited for when it comes to Archer 4 is because in, in this one, they actually delved into his past, and I'm really excited to see what they do with it in the next game, because showing his past a kid, and then later in the game, as you, I mean, if you're watching this, you've probably already seen it, you're just, just watching, but I mean, you're probably, uh, you probably already know that, at least from what... Marlo says, which you'll meet on, her probably by the end of this video. Uh, she is not an Stop actual uh, descendant of Francis Drake, so I'm kind of excited to see where that where that goes. And plus, I'm excited to see how the whole brother how how Sam works into yeah. it. And it sucks I wasn't able to make uh, multiplayer videos is I, I absolutely love the beta. I mean, I wish they had a little more to offer, like, when it comes to maps and such, but, I mean, overall, I mean, I think it was just absolutely fantastic. Right, I'm gonna stop talking now, because we're gonna make it Typical bloody yank. All talk. Hey, 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 hey. Is that enough? Haven't you, mate? Don't. Stay down.
Hello, Victor. Kate? Still wallowing in the gutter with your protege, I see. Not very dignified for a man of your age. Should have known you'd be behind this. Oh, careful now. Wouldn't want you to melt. <laughs> Same cocky little shit. So fearless. I wonder what you're really afraid of. Not bullets or blood or broken bones. No. You get off on all this, don't you? Cheating death. Or not. No. <laughs> Mr. Sullivan, I won't harm your precious boy. I merely want what's mine. Give me that back. Cut her! Oh no. Oh. Shut, Shut up. up! You fool! Oh, you're bloody welcome, Your Majesty. Marlow, we have to get you out of here. Oh, come on. They're a right pair of arseholes. What? Alright guys, I'm gonna uh, leave it here because I don't want to make the video like 35 minutes long because it's just, it's just gonna keep get that long from there. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching and please, uh, if, if you like the video, please just drop a like, comment, and subscribe to become a member of High Society. And I will see you guys in the next video.